Hey, how's it going, everyone? WTF Sexy Headphones here. Happy Mondays or Tuesdays to you guys. Um, this is coming a little bit on late to you guys for uh, if you don't know... Uh, I work in retail. It's very busy during the holiday season. And on top of that, the days that I've had off, um, for those of you who do or don't know, my birthday is in November and it's coming up. So I have family and friends who are visiting me. Uh, so I haven't had time to do anything uh, YouTube wise, just because I either got family or friends or I'm working more retail hours and it's all just this whole like next two months will be chaos for me. So I apologize, but moving on, let's go to something much more cooler. So in my last vlog, I announced to you guys that I have a sweet little Chernobyl puppy. I finally named her, so I will start off with that. Um, it was funny because I didn't like this was a popular name and I didn't want to name her that and then it grew on me. So her name's going to be Katya. I was really, really, really close to naming her Laika. Um, but then John pointed out that I say the words like and ah uh, frequently together. And now every time I say like, uh, all I think of, all I think of saying, like, I think of myself saying the words like and ah, uh, and it just sounds really dumb, but that was really what I was going to name her until he pointed that out. And I'm like, I hate it now. I fucking hate it. Why'd you do this? So her name's Katya now. John still very much calls her Suka, um, cause he's mean. I just call her Suka when she bad, but that is the name of my little Chernobyl puppy. Her name is Katya. I did not bring her in here cause uh, she's not well potty trained yet. And I don't trust her well. And if she pees on my rug, I will be very, very sad. Anyway, moving on. So to the next stalker-like Chernobyl Ukrainian related thing. If you guys don't know, which you really should, I have a sweet, sweet, deep love for the Misery development team. They allowed me to do beta testing for them once upon a time in the past, which was absolutely awesome. I love doing anything part of the stalker community because it's fucking cool. Stalker is amazing. Like anything stalker, Ukrainian, whatever's, Pripyat's, Chernobyl's, it's all awesome. So they released or they're releasing a new um, poker set, which is going to be the Wolves and Crows. So the Wolves one, if I recall right, is going to be kind of, this is what makes me think of Misery. It's going to be like their more um, coppery color scheme, like a little bit more golden. And when I think of Misery, like those are the colors I think of because it's always very fall-like. And then they have their Crows, bleh, their Crows edition one, which is going to be kind of like the more cool grays and things like that. And uh, they just do it so well. So I meant to give you guys this news earlier, and I know I posted on my Facebook fan page, um, I might have posted on my Discord. If not, I'm going to do that after this because I don't remember if I did. Um, but you guys will have roughly a day and some odd change to pledge to them on Kickstarter just because I got to this really late. And I'm sorry, again, as I said, I, I've had family and friends coming out to visit me. Um, and I've been working retail hours for holiday and it's been a little bit crazy. So I apologize. I meant to let you guys know about the sooner. So if it is something you're interested in, links are going to be down below. Pictures so you guys can see the amazing work. Um, you're going to have very little time to act on this and I apologize. I meant to give this to you all sooner. Um, but I've been busy and I am sorry, I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, so anyway, so I'll post some pictures here for you. Um, as you guys know, the Misery Dev team is like my fucking favorite team because Misery is my favorite mar mod. And I'm not just saying that because they let me uh, beta test for them and being like, like the worst member of their like sort of team in a way by just like running around and being like, this doesn't work. That's like all I had like the ability to because you guys know me. I don't know the technical side of things very well, but I enjoyed my time of it. It was awesome. Um, but there's just something magical about playing a game that literally makes you rethink how you have to play Stalker. Like normally, it's kind of like when you know the game well enough, you can kind of just run around and do whatever and it's all fine even when you're playing on um, like the highest difficulty even when you're doing like Master and stuff like that. Like you can just kind of run around and do whatever. So it's kind of, there's some kind of torturous, beautiful magic of the suffering that Misery brings. And plus they have cocaine. So there's a lot of suffering but they make up with it for cocaine, which is like my favorite thing in that mod. I love cocaine so much. Like it's beautiful. It's like my favorite thing in that mod. Like, oh, like every time I play that, because I hate, I hate shitty stamina, which in my current misery playthrough, uh, I've had nothing but shitty stamina. You guys, um, you guys will make fun of me with how much cocaine I use, but I'm just like, it makes me so fast. I go fast. I love it. <laughs> anyway, we're getting off track. So, so as we're saying, link down below to the Kickstarter. Uh, as always, they have like the most gorgeous design work ever. And I always admire stuff like that because I have zero ability to design. I went to an art school. I went to the Art Institute of Phoenix. 
And I went for photography though, but they made me play, take plenty design classes and I can't design for shit. I don't know how to design. I am shitty at it. So I always admire when people can. And you guys have probably seen this a long time ago. And if not, I'll re I'll dig it up. But I made, um, I was in a webpage design class and I made a stalker website. And you can tell how fucking shitty I am if I show you guys that website again, because I can't design. So I admire a lot of people who can. And the fucking Misery Development Team does a fucking phenomenal job with their design work. An absolutely phenomenal job. Like, they have the fucking colors right and the theme. Like, they, like, ooze everything that is the atmosphere of Stalker. And they, like, nail it every fucking time. And I love it. And actually, it's funny because I was thinking because I got, like, with their cards last time at their anniversary edition. And I was thinking about pulling those out recently. I'm like, oh, I think I left them in Arizona. So I'm probably definitely going to have to get one of these new decks because, uh... I think my other ones are in Arizona right now. And that is a bit far for playing cards. But yes, I'll probably go with the Wolves Edition. I love the warm colors. But so for you, as you guys are interested, as I said, you're not going to have a lot of time to act on it. And I apologize. I meant to inform you all a lot more recently, sooner, recent. I think sooner is the word I'm looking for. I meant to inform you guys a lot sooner. Um, but shit gets chaotic for me holiday season for a number of reasons. So I have not been able to get this out to you all. But so link down below to the Kickstarter. You're not going to have a lot of time. You're going to have about a day and some odd change by the time I post this vlog. Um, so if you guys would like to contribute or like some of these awesome cards, you all know they put amazing work into that. And obviously when you check out the website, you'll fucking see. You know that they put amazing work into it, like the amount of detail down to not even just like the fucking cards, but it's like literally the uh, tuck boxes that they come in. Like everything is just like they don't miss a single detail. It's so fucking beautiful. Like I need misery to design my life because it'd be so cool. Like I need to like invite them over to my house and be like, design my game room for me. That'd be so cool. I bet they would do such a phenomenal job. They could probably make this whole thing look like a super sweet misery wasteland. All right, you guys come over to my house. I'll give you my address design this room for me. You're going to have to still somehow incorporate Reaper because my friend gave that to me and I like him a lot. He's like my Overwatch crush because I'm weird. Um, anyway, so moving on. So Wolves and Crows special poker edition cards available very shortly. Link down below. Check them out. They're absolutely beautiful and amazing. Um, other stalker news this is going to be like all about stalker even though i haven't got you guys a video in a little bit um i am now a moderator for the 100 rads bar on facebook if you guys are not a part of it feel free to join again in the link below um unfortunately and i don't know if any of you moderators from it watch this vlog um i haven't had time to do any moderating because the only time i'm on facebook is when i'm at work and um uh, I can only be on it sparingly because it's really, really busy. And when like, the only thing I've been able to really do is like accept or decline people who want to be in the group. So if you guys want to be in the group, um, I am now a moderator. So you will see me pop up occasionally. I will hopefully try and get a little bit more time to make my presence known. I haven't had that time as you all know. Um, but make sure to answer the questions. So you will more likely be denied um, entry if you don't answer the questions. And it's, and it's very easy like, why do you want to join? And who's like your favorite? I think like one of them's like, who's your favorite character? Something. It's very simple. So just answer the damn questions, you guys. And then I will see you and I'll be like, accepted. I have that ability now. I will try and do more moderator things in the future. I just, uh, time is just uh, never on my side these days. And it sucks. I hate being an adult. I want to go back to my college years when I had a part-time job making zero monies. And I did college a little bit. And then I had ample time to do whatever the fuck I wanted. I want to go back to that. That was beautiful. I don't have that anymore. But anyway, so lots of exciting stalker news. Named my little Chernobyl rescue mutt. Her name is Katya. Misery has gorgeous, gorgeous cards out because everything they fucking do is gorgeous. Seriously, come to my house. Design my fucking house for me. That'd be great. There's Godzilla everywhere because I have no design sense. So John just places Godzillas everywhere. And that's literally the design of our house. Godzilla on the fire mantle. We have like one of those really gay home sweet home things that someone got us for a house. And there's two Godzillas over there right next to the home sweet home thing. There's Godzillas all behind me. So come design my home for me. That'd be great. Because uh, John's the only one who's been doing it. It's nothing but Godzilla. And I got my, my, one, my one Reaper. I'm trying to point at it. It's so hard on camera. I got my one Reaper poster and that's about it. Anyway... And then now I'm a moderator 
for uh, the 100 Rads Bar. So as you guys know, I'm always happy and excited and pleased to be more and more a part of the Stalker community because Stalker is my passion as it is a lot of yours, which is why you're here. Because this is a primarily Stalker channel and which is why we're like a little small little collective. This is a small little collective. If I don't know what we're doing, we're coming together. Anyway, I've been rambling long enough. So link down below to the Misery um, Crows and Wolves, Wolves and Crows, I think I messed that order up, cards. You have very little time, so if you're thinking about it, just fucking do it now because I, I dropped the ball on this one. And I'm a moderator for 100 Rads Bar and Facebook. If you're on Facebook, go there. Feel free to join. It's an awesome community. Um, quick disclaimer. They really hate anime there. Not everyone, but I'm going to warn you now. There's like these anime wars that happen on there because stalker fans really fucking hate anime. And then some of them don't. But the ones who really do, it gets wild. I don't know how there's like anime wars on the stalker page, but if anyone posts anything slightly anime, I'm just warning you now, the backlash is real. I will try and make my presence known and moderate that for you, but I'm just letting you know now. It's, it's a very weird problem on that page. <laughs> oh, it's funny, but it's also very strange. Um, Link down below. Make sure to answer the questions and I will maybe see you and be the person who hits the accept button for you. And that's all. You guys have a happy rest of the Mondays and Tuesdays and I will hopefully see you this week in some um, clear sky and some misery. I gotta find some time to record that. I'm gonna see about doing that right now. So, bye! Feel my power!